Hey guys and welcome to episode 5 of my British Development Crow mode. In this episode, we will start off the game against Mites here. I'm actually going to sim a few games while just talking throughout these about the series. But because of that, I'm just going to do a quick little intro here. In the last episode, we actually found some form. Beating Gladback, uh, Ajax, but unfortunately we drew against Augsburg. But it's still a pretty good game, pretty good performance. Yeah, let's jump straight into this game up against uh, Mainz and see if we can pick up a victory. They're currently sitting fifth, same points as us. This will put us closer to the um, the top, which is where we want to be. So, so for a good performance. Eleven for Borussia Dortmund. Here's the initial 11 for Mainz. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing-backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. All right, can he win that? No, he can't. So Dominic Solanke. Mastery of the Sanchez passing game. The former Liverpool. Is it Chelsea at one point Solanke. Well? Yeah, Chelsea, Liverpool and Bournemouth striker. Well, stopped them just when they looked menacing. This career never really went the way people expected it to go. And Borussia Dortmund in a position young, of menace. English player. I don't know well now. He scored this one. Try. Yes, he can. Ten minutes, just over ten minutes in. No wonder not. and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball has ended up in the back of their net. I can't see down here. I just go to the side of the defender and goalkeeper sees it late. It's probably in shares ahead of him. Well, potential and danger. Stopping before they cause any danger. Solanke. Never do. Started him in this game. He hasn't played a game in a while. And a tidy tackle. why I started him though. In the NR, and then the right, Murray down the left. And this Wolf now to bring the ball forward. It's a weighted pass. And Malin now. Pass back into Jimmy Brown. It's a brilliant finish. I just feel like this game is going to be one of those where you score four or five in the first half and just sing the second half. I'm actually just going for scoring records. Well, here it is again, and what a piece of skill this is. It's about the only way to get his shot off that quickly. You'll never get tired of watching this. It's a great goal. Julian Brandt, under a bonus finish. Gets to success. Shot back now. Continues his run. Defending. Yes, he can. But nothing comes of it. Good defending Marino. it was. Very really good pass. There's, there's a slight great draw pass. pass. I think it's just a little bit too far ahead of Hazard, but that was great work from him. And, and Bellingham, Bellingham from range, Full good save. Credit. Wonderful stop. Not from the corner, can we do anything from this? Tottenham has it, Tottenham's one in. Who can he pick out? Just for clearance that was called for. Can he find the net? Couldn't quite hang Forced on. Forced to Malin here. Can do something with this. Ah. Actually, correct. I don't know what's on, actually. Torgan has it from range. Hazard! It's a brilliant finish. Not Christ sure why no defender pressed him. But Torgan has it. A fantastic goal. Well, let's take another look because this is a special goal. He's so Let's far out from the strike. He couldn't have hit that any box. better. Bends it into the far right corner. Fantastic finish from Paul. Totally dominant performance this has been so far. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch. Okay. They've passed it forward. At we wonder who bad. was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. I think they're into midfield. And the fourth official well, confirming that we'll have one additional minute. That didn't really work out. I was hoping the flick on would actually help me there. Got some pace on the ball. Strongly, decisively. Nice Can he make a cut? Well, how does it not end up going in? There we go. 
very scuffed way for it to go in. Yeah. Goal is a goal. Daniel Marlin grabs the second again. Marius Wolf didn't get it this, but it's a good play from him. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. And the keeper gets very unlucky. With, he made a decent save and it hits the crossbar. He gets lucky with that. And it just falls back to Daniel Marlin. And he puts it in the back of the net. Job. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. There's no point in playing the rest of this game. It looks like open road for them, but it's going to want to score one more goal. Well, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. And they're not going to score with me playing, probably. So, it's not about a dead end. Not wish it's actually going home. Don't forget again to be in a position for me to sit. I keep giving the ball away. Possession one. Sula and Arsh, like that, get that away. What's going on? I said, just no enemy field. I need to pass so it. Ranking. Sula, stop that, and, and they score. Time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He it's hits it goal, so cleanly, and the keeper has no finish. chance. That's a great strike. Unfortunately, it doesn't really mean anything for them, because, well, I'm just going to quickly do this and see what the result's going to be when I quick some more jump to result actually we pick up a 4-1 win that's what we love to see so in this game here up against a shit task with the second team so hopefully pick up a win and we pick up a 4-0 win love to see it Adiemi, Witzel, Marius Wolf and Julian Brandt getting on the score sheet and hopefully that'll be enough for us to pick up a victory here. Up against the Mini Bielefeld. Should be. We get a 1 0 loss. Great. That side loses to Mini Bielefeld. Run this side up against uh, Freiburg here in the cup. Hopefully we'll win this. We should do a, a hope anyway. We get a 1 0 win, Daniel Marlon picks up a goal. I just came up against um, uh, FC Colin here, a team that you'd expect to be better. They got uh, De Ketelar in their team. They got Gerhardt, some two decent players there, Jonas Hector. Yeah, hopefully, we pick up a win here, considering we lost our last Sunday game. And we get a 4 2 win, nice. He scored. And Zarkanauf, Bran, Ariemi, and Dan's got. I'd love to see it. So, yeah, let's quick sim this. Hopefully, pick up a win. We get a draw. I mean, it's not the end of the world. But Makoko picks up a actually big goal. And when you look at the, um, the game, they were winning for a while. They scored in the 51st minute. They got a record in the first minute. So, I'm not sure how we didn't do better than that, considering. No red card was a defender. And let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Marcel Halstenberg starts with Vidi Orban in central defence. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. Introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Mats Hummel starts alongside Niklas Zule at the back. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. From him. Well, I think we can expect goals if his form is anything to go by. Pass, that would have probably you just hope that back line has been stuck in the tape because most teams have really struggled to keep him at bay. And that's poor hard to give away. Illegally. Now, perhaps a card is forthcoming. It's well, the referee there, right? has taken note through. of his name and number. Well, I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there, but it was certainly a foul. No way to defend this free kick. I'm not actually going to put a man on line in this one. Gunku takes it. Well, 
and a good save from Cabo. And that's how to make a save. So a corner here. And faith in Cabo there. For some reason I didn't jump at the wall, but I was going wide anyway. Quality to pose a real threat going Good forward, and that needs to change. Emre Chan, Malena, hit that from range because you're going to get press. It's a good strike. Well, the goalkeeper is thankful that it wasn't a better effort than it actually was. Oh, dangerous save from Leipzig. Amadou Haidara. Negredo, can you oh, please stop Nkunku? There's one man we can't let through it, it's Nkunku. Andre Silva. Straight defending there from Holmes. Maris Wolf now. Both. And he's successfully got past now. him. The delivery. Marlin. Oh, oh that's a good header. Is still reverberating. I'm surprised that she won that in the end. See them now. Uh, and Royce getting higher up the pitch as it... Oh, he... Andre Silva. And they've given him too much space. Oh, Hummels has to cover him. Kanku, Hummels, good step in. He's got one last attack. Tobin has a mark, he's got a lot of space ahead of him. Hausenberg's going to come across and try to stop him. No one's really making a good run for him, but Royce now can just place that in. Yes, he can. And it's been finished off! And just before half time, we go one up. Things you love to see. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're good so quick from to get out from the back. Ball well, the a simple in the finish for it. It's such good timing. What a goal! Caught them on the counter attack just before half time. And one up. Can you uh, love to see it? Rafael Guerrero, Torgan Hazard. Not really good enough Hazard. Ball. You can get this forward. Chance to play it in. Can he take advantage? The second time this episode from range. It's oh, a great save. In Galashian, that's a back pass, but I guess we'll just allow it. That's it, rule. It's not in FIFA. Great work from Alan now. Can we keep this side? That's, a, that's what we need to do. It's a good win. Get this into the edge of the box. And they Chan. And they Chan. Royce. A little dink. Oh, oh it's just wide. That would have put them. Oh, I pressed up there and I don't want him to. So I'm just trying to switch to him to well, Marco Royce, frequently back. inspirational, and this game is no exception, Stuart. Well, he certainly all. had an impact on that first half. There. Scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was That's really good, and he got better as the half wore on. Ah, I can probably make a good through. save. Oh, I'm not sure how it's gone through. Not only the pass, but the shot. And the man in good goal scoring for him gets a goal in this game. Andre Silva. One of the top scorers in the league. So I'm not surprised he scored in this game. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch uh, passes is absolutely outstanding to play around the Paul, pressure. The fact and then it went through goal, and then Paul had the shot really through had as well. That he wouldn't slot that away. It's a cool finish. He do something in this game. Adeyemi though. Adeyemi. I mean, you can get away and from Dortmund Berg. in a position of menace. I'll just hit that with power. Brilliant so save. Four back to Royce there. I feel like I shouldn't have taken a February chance. Bundesliga action for you to look forward to here on EA TV. Cabo, that's yours. Why have you played it there? Okay. Wanted to keep it but couldn't. De what is that pass to Hood? Tension building still level. Second. But nothing Great comes of it. I'm not really sure what's going on right now. I feel like we're inside the final high. ten minutes in this one. Those are making small mistakes that are going to cost and us in Bellingham. the long run. Bellingham, no. Cut back. Play that pass. Can Royce. Yes great finish. And that could be oh, Marco so Royce steps up in this game. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass, it's a good run from Bellingham. Good cut back and a pass, perfect. and then Royce the powers the ball past. So. Really Galashi in there, who almost breaks his back. His back there. Okay, why is it Hummels? Not getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Okay, that's a well, pass back. We're both equal now, so and the keeper has even the ball. fan can complain. Even lines. side can complain about pass backs not being given. And Royce now to complete a hat trick. Just needs to stay calm. Be feeds himself here. Slater plays it to Adiyemi, who picks up a goal. 
Well, that's a very worse thing to do, that's why I did it. Give it to the young lad. Let him get a goal. You've got two goals, you might well, as well. Here's the replay, assists. and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. Enjoyed to see. Adiemi picks up a goal. He's needed one for a little bit. Silva. I doubt that's going to happen, despite the game's best efforts, best efforts to stop me from winning. Let's hold the ball here with Griffith Cobalt and the rest should blow the whistle. Not sure why he isn't. You want to blow the whistle, ref? Like... There we go. I wish you should wait that two minutes go. Over. With that, the game is over and it's a victory for Dortmund. What did you think of that performance? Absolutely, Derek. It was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. I'm going to assume this with the uh, second team. If we can pick up a win. I feel like we should do, so... A 2-1 win. We have to see it. Nico, Schultz and Zagadou getting the goals. Yeah, that's still in this game. I came not playing it because, again, when it gave me these kits uh, selection. Yeah, kind of expecting Madeline to score in this game. Let's see if he does. Let's see if we can pick up a win. I wonder when it was Guerrero, actually. At the came on. So did uh, Julian Brunt. I wonder when. If we win this and buy and support, which I don't think they will, will actually go join top, I believe. They've got a very good side, and that's a vast of ranks. Lucas and Mecca, LaCroix, I believe that's how you it. Yeah, hopefully we pick up a uh, win here. And I wonder when Adiemi scores. Let's give our points for the Bremen in the uh, DFP Bokal. Hopefully we can go through. Gonna run the uh, second team here. See if we can pick up a win. Uh, a, a win. I think we should do. We pick up a 4 2 win. Let's see it. Dam's goal scores twice to Hood and Knauf on the score sheet as well. Yeah, what's the word I'm looking for? An episode in which he has to prove himself. We're up against Bayern. If he plays well and in the game, the next time we play him, if he plays well in those games, then maybe we keep him. But if he continues this form that he's shown in recent times where it's been a bit shaky defensively. Then maybe we we'll let him go and bring in another defender, another left back. And I think I know in my head who I want to bring in. I'll show you in the next episode. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Check the uh, descriptions, uh, the description there, the description down below for the uh, links to my social medias and my Twitch, where I will go live on there. And actually, after I record this video, I'm going to be going live. So yeah. You can check that out, my TikTok, my Instagram as well. I have a Discord that I'm, I've made. You might link that down below if you want to join that. And yeah, make sure to check out my uh, Twitch streams as well. It'll be quite fun for you to come along and uh, watch those. Yeah, see you guys next time. Thank you for watching and goodbye.